What up, Raph ladies? Welcome back to my channel. Here we are at the Kingston Seawall here in Georgian Guyana. I'm going to give you an update on the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. Remember, you can visit my website to shop for merchandise. That's channel merchandise. RN brand, R N B R A N D dot online. I have t shirts, jerseys, and sweatshirts, hoodies, and I have over a thousand items now at RN brands at online. All items made in Guyana, designed in Guyana, shipped and delivered free of charge, all included in the price. So go check that out. Now let's take a look at what's happening here at the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center here in Georgetown, Guyana. What up, Raph Leaders? Welcome back to my channel. We're back at Kingston Seawall here in Georgetown, Guyana. And I want to bring you a quick update on the progress here at the Pegasus expansion project and seawall development. Now, last time we were here, they were building what appeared to be a parking lot here at Kingston Seawall. It turns out that it seems as if they're building concession stalls. So these are the structures. There was a concrete surface the last time. They were building a concrete surface, but now you can see they're actually building concession stalls. And this is a drainage system, open drain around the perimeter. I don't know if they're going to put parking lots here eventually, but it seems as if the main construction effort was at building these what appear to be concession stalls. Two of them so far, like bars or places to buy refreshments. So that's what's happening here. Now the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center is nearing completion. I'm going to take a walk around it. As usual, this time from the south side and show you what's happening here. So, so far there are four of these concession stalls. Two of these are almost completed here at the western end of this paved or what will be eventually be paved area. All right, so these are the concession stalls that's looking east. That's the seawall band stand. And so, don't know who designed these, but it seems as if they're doing something similar to what was being done at, what was done at Bartica. Last time I was at Bartica, they were building the same kind of development and concession. Area. So, this is the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. Remember, there are two buildings connected by a walkway. This is the Convention Center, and we're looking at it from the south side. We normally take a look at the north side, the ocean side first, but I'm going to take a look at it from the south side first, show you the front entrance because that's where most of the progress has been made and most of it has been putting finishing touches on the building on the outside cleaning up underneath the building moving away the uh, construction debris and basically clearing up the outside so let's see what kind of progress has been made one last look at what's happening here looking east at the paved or what soon will be paved area near to the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center and now we'll take a look at the entrance to the Pegasus Suites so we're approaching the entrance now I'm gonna make I'm going to film a video in the night because there are some 
light fixtures and light shows that are only visible at night and are quite impressive actually. The last time I was here at night, I think the roof of the building was lit up in blue light or purple light and from a distance it actually seemed uh, a lot like um, like the Empire State Building in New York where they have this colored light show near the top of the building and so I'm gonna come back here at night and show you what this looks like perhaps tonight or this weekend but this is the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center uh, sign on the front wall and that also has some light effects some lighting some backlighting so we're gonna see that at night too the next time we come here at night perhaps tonight or over the weekend this is the entrance to the building as you can see it's more or less completed I think there should be a water feature there is this ambling staircase two staircases I think this one on the left is meant to be some kind of wheelchair access uh, just like the driveway and the, the one on the right is a regular staircase they, they, I think the plans show that there was supposed to be a water feature I don't know if that's gonna be installed later but this is what it looks like more or less completed the guard hut is also completed this is the entrance now of the old Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center in fact both new both two buildings are gonna use this uh, entrance to access the building Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center and the old Pegasus now I'm gonna take a walk around on the north side and show you what's happening at the Atlantic Ocean there was some cleanup exercises there last weekend and I think someone was complaining that the Marriott is beginning to put some barriers to restrict access to the seashore the beach near to the Marriott I don't know about that I'm gonna take a look at it later on see if that in fact is an issue here is the I heart Guyana I love Guyana sign in front of the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. This is also now becoming an important tourist attraction for this neck of the woods. Right, the I Heart Guyana Stein. That building is GBTI's main building. That's the old Pegasus Hotel. You can see it's about a couple of stories lower than the new Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. And this is the walk-in entrance. The vehicle entrance, like I said, is the one we just passed. Let's go around the north side and take a look at what's happening on the other side of the building. This is the Benab, the Umanayana. And there are some, some new construction behind this building in, the, in the, this neck of the woods there is some residential construction going up there we're going to take a look at those buildings a little later on I'm also going to give you an update on the 21 companies that I'm working on it's about time for me to give you a status update on those companies about 8 of them that are online it's going to be 10 of them soon but one of them as you can recall if you go back to that video is a a real estate development company a real estate company and we're going to begin to work on that we're planning to build eco friendly communities here in Guyana and this week I'm beginning to break ground on that company if you're interested in investing in that aspect of uh, the group the group of companies now will be the time to let me know a few people have contacted me show, showed their interest I'm definitely gonna need people who do uh, real estate 
sales uh, but I'm actually more interested in building constructing what will eventually be uh, high-rise apartment complexes high-density apartments uh, condominiums and single-family houses and I'm already securing the capital and the property the land to do that so that's coming up soon that is an update on the status of 21 companies that I'm working on this is Tuesday morning in Georgetown Ghana Tuesday the 28th I believe 28th of March 2022 the beach is cleared usually on a Saturday morning Sunday morning there are cars on the beach there's just one car out there now but this is the north side this is the Atlantic Ocean side of the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center I'm just going to show you what's been happening here since we left since the last time a month ago we were here in fact it's mainly uh, been completed the building has been completed so there's not much change that happened since the last time we were here on the north side at least not visible not much visible change this is the old Pegasus from the north side the only development is small uh, changes that have happened since February the last time we gave an update on this project is that the the government of Guyana has been building some walkways here on the seawall so the walkway has been paved this pavement has been completed the lights what we saw in the beginning is uh, risers for light fixtures. Those have not yet been completed, but the paving stones have been laid here in the walkway. That's the Pegasus Suites, the office tower, and that's the connecting part of the building, the part of the building that connects the convention center on the east to the office tower on the western side of the property and this is what's happening underneath the building on the ground floor there's still some construction materials I suppose to be installed on the inside of the building. I think most of the work in the last month has been taking place on the inside, perhaps the furnishings, lighting fixtures, finishing touches, and so on. So probably tiling of the floors and the ceiling and all that stuff has been going on on the inside. And that, well, that's not visible from the outside. But this is what's happening here, guys. At Kingston, Georgetown, Guyana at the Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. Like I said, I'm going to give you an update in the night because there is something significant happening here at night in terms of a light show, the way they've lit the building. And in fact, if they've done a proper, a good job of the lighting and the landscaping, you know, the install installation of lights on the grounds, then at night, the building will perhaps take on a much more interesting and different appearance from the way it looks in the daytime and so that's what I'm going to bring you next now like I said here the walkway has been completed however this part of construction that is installing these these light fixtures has not yet been completed I think there was a cleanup crew here last weekend last time I was out here cleaning up the trash on the beach but that's kind of an ongoing and consistent effort because the trash comes in off the ocean 
to give you this final shot, this final view, I usually come down here every morning on my morning runs and take a picture. And this view, it shows you the entire uh, building, the entire Pegasus Suite Corporate Center. beach. So that's it guys. Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. If you want to see more content like this, click like and subscribe. In the comments below, tell me know, let me know what you think about the development here at the Atlantic Ocean, Pegasus Suites and Corporate Center. Let me know what you'd like to see at night. I promise to film a video at night of this structure. Tell me what you'd like to see. And share this video with friends and family around the world. Let people know what's happening here in Georgetown, Diana. Later!